eight years in the making. Eight cooling place in Florey. This is the address. There's a wonderful story to this. I've got both uh, Nick and Pete from Luton's to take us through this beautiful property that looks brand new, but eight years in the making. Nick, welcome back to Zango Videos. So tell us, we know owner builder as well. What's the story? Thanks, Cam. Yeah, no, this one's a really special one. Um, it was bought pretty much as a dump. Um, I think it was infested with possums. Um, and then just over the years, the owners just chipped away meticulously, um, redoing the backyard, inside, extending, doing all these things, and ended up with this product that we've got here today, which is just fantastic. When I first jumped online and had a look at the address, I think I saw some of the old pictures, and I thought, mm, that can't be it. And then you drive into the property, and it's very unassuming at the front, isn't it? I think so. Like, And that was the understated approach that they wanted to take to it but then you come through um, just into the main living area and then it just opens up it's a bit like a Pandora's box here so let's have a look at the footprint um, four bedrooms beautiful the, the master bedroom is huge yeah um, that was part of the extension so obviously um, being able to accommodate families and whatnot um, was obviously a really big sticking point for this place um, and a lot of work got put into just practical living so Pete let's have a look around outside particularly what's yeah. your favorite part of the property where do you start? Uh, there's so much out here from the outdoor, indoor entertaining. Um, it's got, you know, outdoor kitchen, TV, to the, the beautiful mineral pool that we see here now. You take a, a walk up to the top here and you've got a grassed area with a fire pit. And then if you're into shooting hoops, then you can go over to the basketball court as well. So it's uh, it's super fun. I can't imagine the kids being in t inside for too long. <laughs> yeah, the, the mini basketball court is incredible that then has a workshop behind it that surely, so yes, if you're on the tools, have a workshop, but that's golf simulator yeah, all over it, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, okay, let's see you swing, let's go. But yeah, no, it's a really special place. Like what they've done here, it, even with the inside, like what Nick was touching on, is it ha everything's been touched. Every little part of the place has been touched, but outdoor as well. So there's so many rooms of fun out here. This outdoor area is just epic, isn't it? Right down to the smallest detail. Everything has been taken care of. As I said, owner builder, and he's brought all his tradie mates in and we've gone top level. That's exactly right. And just to create a usable block, like that's the biggest thing here, Cam, is that the whole block's usable. Um, you know, there's spaces that you can be in the sun, there's spaces you can be in the shade. So yeah, it's really, uh, it's really rare to find things like this. Pete, I know you grow up in this area as well. Yeah, so my best mate lives not 50 metres from here. So if, uh, if you're in neighbours and you find some backyard cricket balls, uh, <laughs> that's probably me uh, from my younger days. But super easy area to grow up. You, you're moments away from Flory Shops, which um, we've got King Fook there, which I'm still a... Uh, Urban Eats participant there and um, and you know you've got Super Barn, you've got Caesars the coffee shop, you're, you're 10 15 minutes walk to Belconnen and just a super easy area to live like we there's St Francis around as well so um, yeah I think come along check it out and I think you'll be ple pleasantly surprised. When I first landed in Canberra many many years ago I lived in Flory and so I'm familiar with the shops and the King Fook restaurant that is old school Chinese isn't it? Oh it certainly is yeah I've spent some dollars there I'll tell you that for free. Yeah. <laughs> Lovely. Okay mate um, who lives here who buys a property do you think who's it's going to best suit? Um, I think the young family um, those don't want to lift a finger and just come into something that's done I think you can have the option of going out to the new areas but when you can live like relatively centrally in something that is pretty much perfect like that's going to be it. Yeah. Okay, how and when are we selling? What's the timeline? Uh, so we're selling on the 20th of April. Um, auction's at 9am. Um, open to selling it prior to the auction as well, but uh, I think there'll be a bit of interest in this one, Cam. Yeah, there absolutely will be. It is so unassuming from the front, and then you come into this mini oasis in Flory. It's been a pleasure. Thank you so much for showing us around, both uh, Nick and Pete from uh, Luton's. Thanks to Zango. Come and have a look at 8 Cooling Place in Flory.